This is Scott with A Action Realty Inspection Services doing another installment of Through the Eyes of the Inspector. Um, lately, we have uh, been writing up an issue with the CSST system, which happens to be a setup like this where all of the lines are corrugated stainless steel. They're uh, somewhat flexible, so you can bend and manipulate those without damaging them severely. Uh, great idea. However, we have recently discovered that these lines um, are needing to be grounded and or bonded back to the electrical system uh, in case of lightning strikes and things of that nature. And um, I've yet to see one actually uh, done this well and so I figured I would go ahead and get a video of this. This is ultimately what we are wanting to accomplish when we are asking homeowners to have their CSST system bonded back to the electrical system for lightning protection purposes. Um, again, this is my first time seeing this uh, done in this manner. Typically, uh, I would just see the bond clamp on this end of the system and usually they call it done. Uh, this ensures that each and, and every individual appliance that is being gas fired is bonded and it is ensuring it. Um, it's hard to see, but they're running feeder wires in here, sort of daisy chained uh, through the system uh, or through these lugs so that um, it all leads back to the main wire, which is then running to the electrical system uh, down below us here. Um, again, this is Scott with A Action, and I am concluding this video.